Hey you folks, Quill18 here and welcome to another episode of Let's Play RimWorld! We are in Beta 19, even though that's not what the title says. We got three prisoners that we're trying to convince to join Team Awesome over here. Winter is here. There's no snow on the ground currently, but it is cold. Chopping down some uh, plants over here just to make sure to control the blight, which seems to be okay. Our little um, greenhouses are fine. Rat Lord. 97% done his Psychite Withdrawal, which is nice. He's still dealing with the flu. Uh, yeah, immunity is ahead of the flu, which is fine and good and dandy, which I suspect will be the case. Medical emergency. Risk of death, severe illness. I mean, you've got a lot of stuff going on, admittedly. Yeah, the flu just reached extreme. I don't think there's any tending I can do to you right now. You just got a lot of stuff that's all stacked up. We don't, have pro we don't have proper medicine, we have herbal medicines. We do have some neutromine. I think we do have the drug lab here. And we do have a job to make medicine, but the problem is... I'm gonna skill is crafting four, intellectual four. Never the twain shall meet. Uh, Rat Lord actually has crafting turned on even though he doesn't have passion for it. I mean, we could sort of slowly train someone up to maybe do something. I mean, too bad Bam can't craft, because that might be something to fill the time. Oh well, it's okay. We, we buy medicine whenever we get a chance to. So we'll just we'll just keep doing what we can. Hope Rat Lord doesn't die. I'll feel especially bad about the whole foot thing then. <laughs> it's like, dude, we're going to set you some bionics, man. It's going to be awesome. We're waiting for some material to be able to build the IE trap as well over here, just to catch future bugs. Uh, treat on extreme. Okay, you're almost immune, which is good. You're going to be fine, and you're at 98% with the psychite addiction. Yeah, you're going to be okay. You're still healing up. Most of our people are fine at this point, which is good to see. Everyone's running around. I like to keep an eye on Toby. I like to keep an eye on my, my haulers. It feels good to see everything being moved around in bulk in this. Um, this new stockpile is nearly done. I may have overdone it on the auto doors, but... Well, yeah, because they break down and they take a lot of components. But I don't know. Um, apparently power can't reach that far, so we'll just... I'll, I'll bring it all the way to the door. We don't actually have to, but I will. Because why not? Maybe we'll build other things nearby and that'll be handy. Um, we do have two guns here. It doesn't technically reach the whole thing. I'm wondering about building one gun in the middle, especially since we have a stockpile and that's kind of valuable. If someone comes over here and starts, like, setting the building on fire, we could actually lose a lot of stuff. So again, I'm still, you know, we could build mini auto cannon turrets. It's expensive. Large caliber shells. Furbished after use. I don't know, the mini turrets are fine. Just uh, set you over here. I think the traps are still going to be a useful thing to have as well to protect these things. Just a couple on this side that's going to be okay. And I will order some of these trees to be chopped for vis visibility. And that's going to be okay. I mean, we don't have to rush to build it. Um, actually, probably it doesn't reach power. Something like that. Okay. I don't have to rush to build it, but I think it'll be handy to have, so we're going to be happy to have that. We got tons of wood again, you know, for good at you, we don't really need this much. All of our buildings are wooden, so they're susceptible to being set on fire, but hey, that's fun, right? A little rhino over here. We could set some hunting jobs, but why would we? We have infinite everything. Uh, we should do a gun pass. Marvin's a pacifist. Charge rifles are really good. Uh, Rat Lord is sleeping. He's got his immunity. War Merchant. Oh, that's good, because usually they... Oh, you can't walk right now. Uh, usually they sell medicine. We probably want to upgrade from the bolt-action rifles wherever we can. So I'll get you to do that. Toby's got a bolt-action rifle as well. So we're going to do this. Alright, let's get the Prakus. As soon as they're a little closer, we'll send them out. Hopefully we can buy some meds. We might be able to sell a lot of obsolete weapons. We could consider buying fancy weapons, but honestly, we we're making our own, so it's not a big deal. Not buying Timberwolves, I don't think. You sell herbal meds. Oh, we're gonna sell Wake Up. Uh, auto pistol, bolt action rifles we can probably get rid of. And maybe the pump shotgun. Uh, we definitely don't use this many cocktails, in fact. I'll keep one because we might have to do something fancy, but otherwise. We'll sell some of this clothes. 
And sure, we'll sell the helmets. Now, I will buy all your herbal meds, because we're actually running really low on that. I guess that's it. You have enough money? Yeah. Well, we'll have more money for the next real merchant that comes up. I guess. Hmm. Okay. Relationship goes up a bit. That's fine. I've got the door there. It doesn't have power currently. How come it doesn't? Oh, yeah, because this isn't actually built. Roofing all this up so we get less deterioration. Good. What's Toby doing? Harvesting some trees, right, which is something he likes to do. Ratlord is up and moving. We did take all the good guns away. We could go and put him. I'll, I'll equip you with an SMG for now so you have a weapon. Still moves super slow. Psyche, 100% withdrawal. That must be a rounding error. But yeah, it's got the minus 20% moving from that. Once his flu is completely gone, and he's getting movement penalty from this as well. Once the flu is completely gone, the addiction is completely gone, hopefully we'll have our bionic leg. I don't think we've gotten around to finishing it yet, though. Is someone specific working on it? No, literally no one's working on it now. I might have set it to two. I'm not sure. What's Dark doing? He's just chilling. I'm going to get you to come over here and finish working on some of the jobs you had going on, buddy. Yeah. Charge rifle? That would be good. We want more charge rifles. They're the best weapons. They don't have the longest range, but they do huge damage. They have pretty good range and huge damage. You just turn into a death squad at that point. All right, resistance is getting super low. Mm, some are still a little higher. That's okay. Low mood. I guess some of the, the poor mood and everything like that is making it a little harder to convince these guys. The fact that they're all together. Colonists needs rescue. What happened to Dark? Go juice addiction. And I'm sure someone's getting around to you. It's your own damn fault. That go juice binge sucked. Hopefully you can go through withdrawal fairly quickly. I don't know if there's um if the length of time it takes to get over an addiction is constant or not. Done over here though. That's good. Uh, crypto sleep caskets. So we'll get the Starflight basics now. There we go. Good, good, good. Outlord doesn't think he has anything to do. Really? Huh. I guess that's why you had crafting on. So you can do some things despite not having passion. Some of it doesn't require a ton of skill. Which is good. We could have you carving blocks or something. Although, making the, um... Making the smoke leaf joints is very good. Yeah, they're leaving, which is fine. Um, because that's something good to sell. And our people can smoke that and become happy and have a very low chance of becoming addicted. Tap, 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 tap. Lots of repairs were left to do over here. It's good to do that before we get the next attack. So we got a bit of a break because we got a lot of attacks back to back to back, which is why we've got so many damn prisoners all at the same time. A muffalo is pregnant. That's very exciting. You're walking this way. Not really the shortest path. I guess, yeah. We might want to build a little um, bridge that goes this way. Actually, I kind of like that idea. Is it under structure? There you go. It's kind of a wide bridge. I like it. Although, from an aesthetic point of view, I might want something... I don't know, we'll start with that. I might widen it and then build it more this way. I'm not sure. We'll do this, which will be more than enough for a bridge for now anyway. There's no reason to have it any wider. So we'll do that. Could even extend it this way. Hell, we could cover all the river up with a giant bridge. It's a big, like, giant pier over the entire river. I don't know. It doesn't make... What was the function? I mean, at some point, it was probably a bunch of docks and things, and then, you know, we don't need ships. I mean, we literally don't have ships in the game, so we may as well cover it all. We got the wood. We got the construction skill. Like, what's the big deal? Prakis is going to try to re uh, recruit Cantrell, which is pretty hard, because she's still... She, he, is still pretty miserable. Eight kibble? We feeding these people kibble? I didn't know that was a thing that could happen. Can we control what kind of food prisoners get? We feed prisoners kibble? I mean, don't get me wrong, that's very food efficient. Resistance been broken. Good, okay. Um, huh. <laughs> I, I don't know, I just find it very funny. I, at first I was like, oh, that's bad. And then I was like, no, that's practical. And then it's just, now it's funny. All right. 
Fair enough. We have tons of meals. Or do we? By tons of meal, I mean we have literally zero meals. Wait, what? We have visitors. You're making kibble. Um, okay, and you're cooking meals. I think they're getting eaten basically right away. Or, oh, they maybe. I don't know. We have multiple cooks, which is fine. We might want to set up a, next, a second cook stove. We might want to redo this whole area. What I could do is instead of having this be a dining room, I could build the dining room somewhere else. Actually, it would be really nice to build it over here once this gets dry. Maybe I should just build... Oh, recruit. How about I just build another moisture pump? You know, why not double up on them? Hell, we could do more than just that. And that might be a little excessive there. Uh, we've recruited Hyun. Excellent. All right. What you got for us? so-called blacksmith uh, bed rest basic that's gonna be fine turn that off you can cook Yan can cook and so can you um you're also a great crafter we'll probably leave it like this I mean you're better crafter than cook but making sure that we're processing the food is so freaking important I think it's fine to leave it this way uh, you're making kibble hooray how about I give you a weapon since you don't have one right now yeah, because that's occupied. And this is also a cooking job. I'll make sure that both things are happening all the time, which is good. But yeah, I'm wondering about something else with the cooking. Mmm. We have insect meat. You've been broken as well. Okay. Uh, we should have plenty of bedrooms. Yeah, oh, no, 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 yeah, yeah. We're good there. Group of travelers. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go and remove that bed so you actually sleep in a proper bed. So that'll make you a little happier. Found some fun over here, which is good and dandy. We might want more than one of these deep drills. Oh, you can see the steel is starting to go away. This is more than one person with a mining job could be doing stuff. I don't know. It's not like we've got a bunch of idlers. We need to rename you. Um, I need to bring up my list of thingies. Uh, there we go. I didn't have my list of thingies up. But now I do. Okay. Do, 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 do. We're going to have... Oh, this is a name I remember seeing before. Hyun is now going to be called... Where is it? Bio. Then here. Cucumbinator! Welcome to the party, Cucumbinator. May you cook well and blacksmith better. So yeah, I have, um, the reason there's so much kibble being made right now is because we have a forever kibble job with insect meat. And we have a bunch of insect meat kicking around. And that's okay. Oh, some of it's rotting away over here. It's winter, but it's only six degrees. Oh, yeah, so the sooner we can cook it, the better. Cucumbinator, having a bit of a joint, which is fine. And then drinking some milk. All right, and we got a zut and a fire. Zut alor. I think it fixed right away. Bamsa bus is in confusion. And then more things are rotting away because it's not cold enough this winter. We're in a fairly, like, warm, sort of deserty climb. Oh, that's a lot of rotting. That's, that feels bad. I mean, it's not like we're short on food, but it, it feels like waste, you know? So it feels... It hurts, man. And then you got to walk all the way over there to drop that, which is also not very good. But what are you going to do? And you're cooking more fine meals, which then get dropped all the way over there. I could just have you... Drop the food as is? I don't know, man. But yeah, if we move the dining room, and again, I think I like the idea of moving it here. So we just really need these things to finish drying up. Um, I like the idea of expanding our food storage over here and maybe our cooking area at the same time. Bam, is, are you... Did you double up on the confusion? No. No, you did! You became unconfused and then became confused immediately again. Damn! Well, that sucks. Toby, what you hauling these days? Are you consuming a fine meal? Sure. Which we don't have very many. Like, basically, we have full-time cooks, but we have so many people in here that one full-time cook is not enough. And we do have enough people with cooking skill. And something to lay out isn't helping. Hap, helping. Um, all right, well, for now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to move this statue here. Hopefully someone gets that real soon. I don't know who does stuff for building. 
Minifest. Uh, already working. Oh, excellent. Um, and then what I'm going to do, production, electric stove. Oh, we might not have all the components. Uh, no, we probably do. They're probably just not all in the right place. We're going to get that there so we can start cooking anyway. I notice some things aren't being built, so I'm a little worried about our components and and or steel. We need a trade caravan that can sell us steel. Another new recruit. Lem Gardner has recruited Mitch. And by Mitch, of course, we mean... We mean... Mira, 723. Excellent. Welcome to the group. Sandra's psychically deaf. Mm -hmm. This, turn that off, turn that, turn that. Off, off, you can haunt, you can mine, and you can art. And that's it. But you can be the full-time artist. Now, Marvin Drake is also set to art, but probably will spend all their time cooking. And then mining as a secondary thing, which I think is fine. Okay, that's going to be okay. We can leave your hunter trait turned on. That's going to be fine. We'll just give you a weapon, and then you can go and do your own thing. And then we'll probably get more more art more consistently which is good okay you're still working on building this colonist idle mira is idle can you not art oh we have a statue on the way that's what it is um make large sculpture i don't know we'll set up another one um do forever do forever i don't think oh we don't want you ever do it with steel Stone blocks and wood is fine. There you go. Set up a trio of them so up to three people can have active art projects. There you go. You're just going to haul that out of the way and get started on your own, which is fine. And again, hopefully more stuff for us to sell. You just need to get Cantrell, who, if I recall correctly, had some pretty decent... Hey, you get the medical skill and the cooking skill. New lovers! Zambezi tried to flirt with Kitchen by comparing her to a manic bush. What? Became aroused. <laughs> Wow, the pickup lines that I didn't know would work. Dark still in bed, poor guy. We're still waiting for various legs and things to be built. Lem's doing some cleaning, which is wonderful and good. 8th of December. -y. It's 2 degrees, 3 degrees. Wandering around. Oh, we, right, we dismantled a bunch of stuff. So there's some stuff to pick up over here. There's a little bit more silver here and there that we can actually mine out naturally, which I guess is good. But yeah, we might want to double up on this. Digging at silver ore. Mm -hmm. Oh, and this is too. You know what? I will build a copy over here. Oh, we don't have enough components stored. Yeah. Need some trade to, to go on. We will build this. And it'll be nice to have. And then here, so you've got all your steel. You're waiting on components. Which people will get to it at some point. Marvin's totally idle? Because oh, you don't have a cook station. Put a low-level craft on you. Oh, no, you're back to cooking. Okay. Unhappy nudity. So Rat Lord's missing some clothing. Making some joints. You're working on your statues, which is fine. Um, yeah, we need the other cooking station. Yeah, we need these components. If we could have some trade of some components, that would be so nice an unfinished component. I'm going to cancel this charge rifle because that might give us some stuff. And that was Dark who can't do anything right now. Hmm. Cucuminator. Do we actually want to change your priorities? I don't know, man. Maybe. You're resting. Which I guess is fine. And Minifest? You're making simple helmets. Can I get you to go over here and work on this station instead? You're going to work on this component, which is good. It's a start. Hmm. It is nice that there's, like, the fabrication bench can do a lot. For a while, it was just, like, the bench that you did components at really didn't do much. Okay, you're making some more. Yeah, just, just bulk create that. That would be really helpful for us. Please and thank you. All right, it's nice and cold anymore, so if there's any more meat over here that hasn't rotted out already, uh, it'll stick around. But I don't know if we've got... I mean, the milk, maybe... 
Oh yeah, we got tons of meat over here. Durr. Okay. But we still need more cooks, which mostly means we need more components. Uh, I'm going to cancel this to make sure this doesn't steal any components away from anything else. Minifest, you're still working on components now? Good. Excellent. Yeah, we got the job to keep 30 around, but we got so many other crafting jobs that are also in the queue. We want to prioritize components. I suppose I could cancel some of these others, but what am I going to do? Cancel armor? I suppose we could cancel, like, making weapons. Uh, which is actually over here. But the armor's too important. We do still need a leg. Suppose I'll move the uh, charge rifle down below the component making. Because we need components for lots of things. We don't want the components to get used for the rifles right away. We might need them for structures that are more immediate. And I think that's pretty fair to consider. Okay, more components being made. There we go. The cooking station is open. Um, now... I just paste one, right? So copy, paste, copy, paste. I suppose I could have built a copy of this and then it would have, I think it would have copied all the jobs over. Bulk goods trader, yes, that's what we need. Prakis, come over here, give him a call. We need steel, we need components. I mean, mostly just that. Where the hell were you? <sighs> um, we'll keep our dogs. We'll keep our, our mufflers and things. It's going to be okay. I'll keep our kibble with me as well. We could sell the meats. We do have an excess. I'm actually very tempted to do that, especially since it might rot. I think that's fair to do. Um, I will buy all your components. I don't think I'm going to buy the advanced, even though it could be handy. Leather. Um, we'll sell these joints. Steel. Okay, that's fine. We still have money. Could buy some extra plasteel or something, or even just sell some wood, but then we have to chop more. We'll just get rid of these pants. Uh, we'll keep the gold because we might need it. I think this is a fine way to do it. We buy a bunch of components and a bunch of steel. I think that's perfectly acceptable. I don't know, maybe we should buy the advanced components. He's only got one. You know what, let's do it. We might need it for some of the bionic parts and things, and we'll be happy to have it. Probably we'll... We need to build... Advanced components get built out of regular components, right? Yeah, just one, but other things. Yeah, okay, no, that, that's very legitimate to have bought that at the same time. Okay, and hopefully uh, Toby from HR is going to be collecting a bunch of that. Oh, you're feeding some meals to Dark, which is fine. Hauling some steel around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's plenty of stuff that needs to be hauled. We've got the extra cooking station, which hopefully people are cooking at both. I don't know. This, this, All this walking is still a pain. Now, I could get people to just drop the meals where they are. Um, I don't know. What's the button for that? Is that something you only do with one of the mods? Oh, right here. Uh, drop on the floor. Drop on the floor. Same thing here. Now, I mean, if they're not collected, they'll get rotted, but I think they added the extra, I think the, 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 the sort of smart hauling is now built into the game. So if there is room over here, I think the cook will haul it while they go and get some extra parts. But more or less, we're just gonna wait for someone else to come and haul it. Plus, I mean, people who are eating are just gonna eat from right there, which is gonna be okay. Um, we're making some simple meals. Okay, but there we go, some other stuff. Yeah, see, more meat just rotted away over here. I suppose I could have sold the insect meat, but it wasn't as valuable. Hide in room. Oh, you're depressive. I saw a webcomic on the, um, on the Reddit, subreddit, for someone hiding in the room, and the, like, the solution was, okay, well, then we'll just tear your room apart. You don't have a room anymore. Ah, you can't hide there. Done. So yes, we really want still Cantrell to jump in, but we've got some good people. Oh, I don't think I set these restrictions. I don't think any of them are night owls. Oh, you are, Cucuminator. Boom, boom. There you go. I think that might be it, though. Bio and you. Yeah, Industrious is a very nice trade. They work faster. We still have tons of bedrooms. That's not a problem in any way whatsoever. Okay, I think this is probably a good place for us to put in a bit of a cut. 
it's nighttime, there's not a lot of excitement going on. How are you, oh, sorry, progressing along, Cantrell? You still have, a, you started with a lot of resistance and you're still difficult to recruit. You're gonna be hard work, but at least we got the others and that makes me very happy. You know, you've got a fairly nice room. A little bit of pain, constraining clothing because you're, uh, you're oh no, you're a nudist. Yeah, we'll see. You had a ton of rivals, <laughs> wow. <laughs> Spacious interior. I mean, you're you're actually in a fantastic mood, which is good, which should help us uh, eliminate the resistance a little faster. Okay, so we'll put a cut in here. Thanks for watching, folks. We'll see you guys next time.